disgusting with Parmesan. So let's try. It's good. Where's my mm -hmm. fresh tomato chicken Thank you, my pasta? Dear. Cooking uh, chicken pasta today. Alright, my dear, have your video all queued up. We will see how this turns out. I have lots of garlic here. There, garlic. Well, I already messed up. Because I put the chicken on first, which made the board wet, and now I gotta do the garlic. Garlic, the garlic paper is just gonna stick to everything. I'll just do like you do. You love bowls. Oh. I tried it like this. I remember the first time I did this, you made fun of me because I was going so slow. That got my hands dry. It's much easier to work with these now. I got fancy smancy heirloom tomatoes. And this one looks like a tiny pumpkin. Maybe when you get here, you could grow some tomatoes in our, in our yard. So the chicken, supposed to, uh, breast chicken. Normally I use breast chicken, but I don't have breast chicken right now. So I'm using Thai chicken. So slice it and strip like this, okay. small Chicken. ones. I'm boiling water right now. Actually, the water is boiled. I used to get all the boilers. Right. That's the next thing. Okay. So this time I'm gonna be using linguini, linguini pasta number one. Normally, I use fettuccine in order. Got some fettuccine. Chili flakes. Which chili flakes is optional. I know you don't like chili. You don't like hot food. So maybe you can just use a pinch of chili flakes. But I normally put lots. I decided to live a little wild and got some red pepper. I'll put a, a little bit in it. I actually got some cayenne. Put the butter in the pan. You used a lot of butter. I can't open up butter. Do something. So much butter. This might as well just be called butter chicken and pasta. See, it's not, it's not, it's not hot. The chicken. No, it's not popping. This is the chicken Alright, where am I? Uh, okay. I was adding chicken flavor to the butter. Okay, I gotta turn this off. This is doing nothing. Okay, you push this off the center heat. Put the garlic. And then you put in your garlic. Smells good. It smells good. Yeah, so when I was in quarantine, this is one of the meals that you brought me. And you can put the fresh tomatoes. And put the pasta noodles now. Because it's ready. It's al dente. Mm, yeah. I don't think there's going to be enough noodles. Okay, a little bit of red pepper. When I say I'm putting a little bit, I mean ever so little. Oh, if you have so fresh vegetables, you can use fresh vegetables as well. That yeah. much. You can also put the fresh uh, basil. Uh, yes, basil. My secret, a little, a little of this. 
And then you can put the cheese. I know, I know. Oh. You grated drawers and all cheese that stuff. Here. Cheese, cheese, cheese. The cheese I'm using is just an ordinary cheese. Well, is that enough cheese? You can use your gold oh, cheese. Covering it so that the cheese melts a little quicker because it's just, I took it right out of the refrigerator, put them on top. Fresh base. Keep the heat inside. So that's so, it. Put some added dusting of Parmesan So to let's it. try. It's good. Where's my mm -hmm. fresh tomato chicken Thank you, my pasta? Dear. I can add some pepper though. Mm -hmm. 